play again. Get a chance to get those cigarettes back. I'm scared, man. Don't got too many friends on the outside. Not anymore. Just keep your eye on the end game. Everything will fall into place. I'm gonna miss you, Chess, man. Listen to me, Eugene. Every day you out there, you out there for me and every other brother in here. You're never gonna be out there again. I made this for you. Take care of the king. Everything else follows. You need a car? Actually, I'm friends with Jamal. I'm here about a job. Right. right. Yeah. Well, we got some spots in the night shift. What kind of late hours you keep? I'll keep whatever hours you need me to keep. <laughs> Good answer. Good answer. All right. Fill that up. Great. When could you start? When I was clever. <laughs> a lot of guys who come in here looking for work. Head cases. Or ex-cons at best. When'd you get out? Hello, Eugene. Jeannie? Is that you, baby? Oh, my goodness, Trini. Uh, you want your usual? Extra chocolate? No, I can't. I have class. What are you studying? Pre-law. <sighs> my daughter's gonna be a lawyer. <laughs> Listen, Trini, I know it's been a long time, but... Uh... Well, I'm, I'm sorry, I just... I don't have time for this right now, but I wanted to come tell you in person. Marco's locked up. He's been in juvenile detention for almost a year now. Selling drugs. I really have to go now. Uh, wait, wait, Trini, please. I really have to go, Eugene. I'm sorry. Take care. Oof. 
What's up, boy? It's been too long, man. Yes, sir. I'm out. You got a place to stay? Halfway house. Oh. I can hook you up with a car. Remember Andre? Dre? He's got a crown thick. Just sitting there. Word? Beat up on his last legs. So no brother really wants to take that off his hands. Watch this. I can grab it for you. I It'll do you some good. It. Yes, sir. Thank you, my brother. <laughs> what I really need is a job, though. <sighs> Money is just, cash is tight, man. Yeah. Seems like nobody wants to hire an ex-con. Parole board didn't set you up? There's a waiting list. Mm. Really a couple of weeks, at least. Look, man, I do maintenance over the Maud Allen School. Mm -hmm. I can try and put a good word in for you. Is that right? Yeah. It's not so bad if you don't mind hanging around kids all day. I hung around a lot worse. You can't make any promises now. Hey, no, I'll be. It's all but, good. Uh, what about Perry? Hmm? You still hang around? Oh, yeah. After you went in, he became the man around here. Word? Yeah, he's got his hands on some everything, man. Good for him. <laughs> what? I'm glad you came home, Eugene. I ain't got nowhere else to go. to the chase. I'm a real hard worker. I'm disciplined. I keep to myself. Well, I, I haven't even given you a job description yet. <laughs> well, whatever it is, I'll get it done. You know, we've been losing our funding left and right, so uh, the pay wouldn't be very good. I understand. How long have you known Billy? Since I was 14. Well, he speaks highly of you. Like I said, the, uh, the pay won't be good, and the kids, well, they are um, a handful. <laughs> well, I'm real good with children. I got two beautiful kids of my own. I know how to handle them pretty good. Well, when would you be able to start? Yesterday. You. Look at you. <laughs> Just living a good life. <laughs> hey. So you out now? I'm out. Look, I just want to say, okay? Okay, okay. let's let the past stay in the past, all right? You're not even going to give me a chance to say what I was going to say. If you need anything, anything, okay? A job? A lady. Why don't you give me a call? All right. I, the way I'm living now, what I got now, <laughs> I owe you that. Here's my number. Don't be afraid to use it. Hey, boys. I'm looking at a living legend. One of the last true soldiers. I used to run behind him. They ain't like us, Gene. They don't appreciate it. <laughs> hey, I want you to call me. All right? Let's go. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> 
looking at me why are you even in detention clip why do you even bother showing up here if you don't give a damn about anything least of all your future at Maud Alton you're tripping Miss Gadball why you think I'm up in here huh these are my best customers <laughs> <laughs> I want you both in prison Tell you I saw Katrina. My baby's gonna be a lawyer. Oh yeah, Trini. Yes sir. <laughs> she was always bright. That one. Got that right. <clears throat> How about Marco? Now, what exactly happened in here? Yo, what you talking about, Miss King? I mean, you know, where Miss Gadbar go? <laughs> she won't be here for the rest of the day. Did I mean we get to be out for the rest of the day, too? <laughs> <laughs> no, that doesn't, T. Now I'm going to find a replacement monitor. Each of you will act responsibly while I do so. Is that clear? Miss King, have a good day now. Everything all right? No, actually, um, Miss Gadball, the detention monitor. Um, Mr. Brown, would you mind doing me a quick favor? It'll only take a minute. Now, if there are any problems in here, Mr. Brown will report them directly to me. I'm not joking. Thank you so much. I'll be back with the monitor soon. It's fine. Oh, your mom. Hey, y'all supposed to be out of your seats? <laughs> Hey, man, we just getting up so you can clean the gum off the bottom of my chair. <laughs> I got to go to the bathroom. Not until Miss King gets back. She'll be back in a minute. What's your name, son? I'm Percy Hall. Yo, sit down, Peanut. <laughs> Peanut? Is that what they call you? Oh, what you want, girl? What you want? What? Hey, hey, all right. That's enough now. Come on, y'all. Have a seat. Sit down. You let me go to the bathroom. I can look sit stay there. No deal. Hey, I'm not gonna tell y'all again. Sit down. Yo, relax, man. Hey, man, we ain't gotta listen to no janitor. You ain't no teacher. <laughs> Have a seat, son, right now. Or what? You some kind of tough guy? You want to find out? Huh? Sit down. She nodding your head for a peanut.
Trini! How do you know where I live? I looked you up. Just because I went to jail don't mean I can't read. Doesn't mean you can't read. Oh, hey, Trini, Trini. It's Katrina. Sorry, Katrina. I got a job at your old school. I know I made mistakes in the past. A lot of mistakes. I'm just trying to make things right. That's all. I'm just trying to make things right with you, Katrina. You're my girl. Trini. You're my girl. Trini. Ms. King? Ms. Brown. Thanks again for the other day. I was, um, I was really impressed. You're welcome. Well, and I'm off to a meeting. I keep up the good work. Oh, uh, about the other day? Uh, when is Miss Gabbard coming back? She's not. Oh, uh, uh, well, what are you going to do about detention? Why are you going to church, What's going going in these parts? I missed my bus. was late. I don't plan on making it a habit. Maybe you should. I'm here. Name's Michelle, right? I'm T. I know who you are. All right, let's go. Everybody, have a seat. Look who it is. You here to clean the blackboard? <laughs> <laughs> For those of you who don't remember, my name is Eugene Brown. Did that mean we can call you Jeannie? <laughs> That'd be the last thing you ever call me. What's that? This here is a chessboard. Anybody know how to play chess? Hey, yo. You think you're pretty smart, huh? Why don't you come up here and play me a game then? You corny, man. I ain't playing no games with you. What's your name, son? Clifton. And I ain't your son. Fair enough, Clifton. Big bad Clifton. Well, OK, if you ain't got the guts to play me, Clifton, is anybody else? Anyone? Yo, I play this. You like cards? Fine. We'll play cards. All right. <laughs> Here's the deal. If you win, the whole class gets to do whatever they want for the rest of detention. Oh, oh no. what? Hey, yo. Yeah, yeah. Get this yeah. But if I win, you learn a new game. You hustling me? Hustle? You don't want to want to play cards, homie. You right. Now. Go ahead and play this clown, Peanut. You never get beat. You know the game? Find the red ace? Huh? My name is Peter Paul. I come from Montreal. Came to play them all. I've broken hipsters and slicksters, elbows and a-holes. Your name is Peter what? Go ahead and pick the one you like. Ah, ah, ah. Reggie dead, Jack. Man, I see it. I see it. Don't you worry about me seeing it. <laughs> see, here's what happened to you. You thought you knew the truth, but it wasn't there. And it never will be until you learn where to look. So he's messing with you, Peanut. Man, I can catch it. All right, look, I, I was just screwing around, man. Let, let me get one more shot. One more shot? Yeah. My name is Peter Paul. I come from Montreal. I came to play them all. Ah! Make sure you see it.
this is a king. This is your life. One mistake and it can be taken away. It's gonna be the meeting spot. All we gotta do is go in there, grab the stuff, and be out. You get the money yet? Nah, man, I ain't seen my uncle in two weeks. What the hell are we gonna do, Cliff? Look, I don't. Look, man, if I can't get the money, and... get it, man. We're just gonna lift it. My cousin gave it to me. Let's fly, right? You know I don't roll like that, Cliff. Well, how do you roll? You don't see what a good opportunity this is? Huh? You ain't got no job, you ain't got no money, you ain't got no opportunity, your mom's half gone well, out shut of Shut up about the... my mom, Yo, that's man. the truth to you, you know it. Look, man, we pulled this job off and we ain't got to worry about nothing no more. Nothing. Think about that. Now, everyone on the board is here for one reason and one reason only. To protect the king. That is right, to protect the king. Now, he is old and has survived many battles, so he can only move one spot at a time. So who's got his back if he can only move one spot? The queen. Now, she is smarter, faster, and stronger than her king. <laughs> The knight is the horse. Now, he can move two spots forward and one spot to the side. The trusty bishop is his diagonal attack. The rook, he patrols the entire board. He can move as many spaces as he wants as long as it's in the same direction he was moving. Ah, yes, the pawns. They are the front line. They will be casualties. Perhaps born, man. Kids game. What you read? Let me put it to you this way, the way you'll understand. Think about it like this. Uh, who's your supplier? Are you tripping? Hey, I know you ain't growing that weed you're selling, and so does everybody else in here you're trying to sell it to. So who's your guy? Huh? Hey, you're ace in a hole. <laughs> trying to protect your king. I like that. Okay. All right, well, then let's call this King uh, Perry. King Perry it is. Now, King Perry has an army, and you're a part of it. But the problem is, you think you're out there doing the king's business, all you're really doing is sacrificing yourself. Like the pawn, you truly are. It ain't like that, B. It's exactly like that, partner. Now, if you want to keep making the same mistakes for a king who could care less about your ass, out there is the board to do it on. But if you want to learn how to make the right maneuvers, this is where you do it, right here, on this board. So what do you want to, what do you want to do? You want to learn how to play? Play it out, man. I'll play. Me too. There it is. Very nice. Man, Peanut, that ain't the right move. Use the horse, it moves in and out. Right there. No, man, right there. What are you, blind, man? Tahim, why don't you play your own game? Man, I'm just watching. How did you see that attack? What you didn't see? It's obvious. Peanut's just stupid. Hey, Mr. Brown. Hey, what you doing? I'm trying to get a ride, man. A ride with that fool. I'd rather walk. Let's go. Right up. 
here. Hey, 23. Oh, man. That's T's mama. You all live here? Yeah, T eats at my place every night. Her mama don't cook. She real messed up, man. Yeah. Thanks for the ride, Mr. Brown. Anytime, son. Take care of yourself. No, Michael, please. Please, man, have a seat. Come on, man. Please. Thank you. Thank you, son. Did you get any of my letters? Well, I've been out for a couple weeks now. I've been teaching these kids chess down in the old neighborhood. I got this one kid that reminds me of you. Who the hell do you think you are? You never taught me nothing. You're the last person that has a right to be talking. Okay. God! No, Mark. Mark, wait. No, Mark, wait. No, wait, son. Don't be like that. Son, please. Everybody look up here. Can you see this? There's an open tournament in Virginia in a couple of months. You're not ready for no tournament. Yeah, that might be true and that might not be. But one thing's for sure is you're never going to find out if you don't give it a try. If anybody wants to road trip, there'll be a sign-up sheet. I ain't trying to be white, man. Fine, white goes first. White goes first. See, that shows you how stupid this game is. Hell yeah, black always gotta go first. Hey, Amen. T, you could be one hell of a player, but your problem and everyone else in this room's problem is you don't give a damn about rules. Especially you. What's the word? You got my money? I know it's not as much as usual. You damn straight it's not as much. Sells it down. <laughs> Sales are down? But you an economist now, Negro? know Eugene Brown? Yeah. Yeah, I know Eugene Brown. He's my man. Well, your man is still in your business. Because I'm just saying. And he runs the tension over there at Ma Alton now. He telling kids not to buy from me no more. Hold up. Eugene Brown runs the tension? <laughs> <laughs> That's hilarious. <laughs> yeah, get the hell out of here. Hey. You better start turning over more product. I'm not even going to think about hooking you up with that big job I've been telling you about. Understand me? Go. There's who you know of a Maude Alton that uh, can do Uncle Perry a little favor. Thank you. 
Baby. Wait, 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 wait. Damn, it's just my friend. I mean, I'll make you some dinner. I got some spaghetti. Oh, baby. No one, baby. Bar, get in like that. Get out! Talk to him! Get out! What's wrong with you? Don't go in, go in! Come back at nine, okay? Gotta go to school in the morning. In here, you're either teaching lessons or you're learning them. You must think before you move. Hey, peanut! What are you doing? What did I just say? Think before you make your next move. And you didn't. Y'all gotta start paying attention, man. In here and in life. Because out in the streets, it's not checkmate. It's incarceration. It's wheelchair. Man, I can't take much more of this. Peanut, get up, bro. I got you. You want to start over? I got him beat. No. Go. This is all I need. Check me. Hey. Where'd you learn how to do that? I told you it's just a simple, stupid game, man. That's something I want to talk to you about, all right, man? What's up? Can't tell nobody, all right? I won't. I'm serious. I won't. Me and Cliff, we got some real things going on. Real easy money. And I want you in on it with me. What you want me to do? Try it. Just in case, you know? No, all I got to do is roll. Yeah, man. You trust me? I trust you. I want you in on this with me. For real. All right. My man. OK, so that, that's what I got to wear this time. Uh, what about it, though? Nothing, because you got to airball it. Oh, I did it! Uh -oh. I'm a beast! Oh, I'm man. a beast! What? I told you on the ball! Miss King, you said you wanted to see me? Oh, yes, I, I, I did come on and have a seat. This isn't easy for me. Who gave you this? Someone dropped it in my mailbox yesterday afternoon. Listen, I'm not the same man I was back then. You lied to me, Mr. Brown. <sighs> I have to let you go. Uh... these kids, man, they're learning. I'm up against the wall here, though. And I, and I don't have a choice, I'm sorry. <sighs> Chess is no different than life. These suburban kids, they know they get good grades. They go off to college. 
They know they're gonna own their own business someday. They envision the end game. But poor kids don't think like that. Mr. Brown, I'm... I wasn't taught like that. I didn't, I didn't see the end game, and it cost me, man. It cost me big. I know. I am still here for you and the chess program. Just not in the school. Not anymore. Get back to class, Peanut. You mad at me? No. But, uh, chess club is canceled. What? Why? Politics. Politics? Man, that's an excuse. What about finding our way out of a corner? What was I thinking, man? Chess. I just had to see this place again. Word on the street is you lost your job. Look, it's hard out there for an ex-con. And the system's not even set up to support going straight. It's just the world, baby. Trying to keep another beautiful black man down. <laughs> <laughs> it's all right, though, because I'm going to help you out. I owe you at least that. So, um, Why are you looking at me like that, Mean G? <laughs> huh? All right, all right. There you go. Oh, oh. You don't have to do nothing for this. It's on the house. You just don't get it, brother. I'm one of the pillars in this community now. Look, I help these folks out the way that the government don't have the time or the means to. I'm gonna help you out a little bit, too. Come on home, baby. Come on home. It's always good chatting with you, Perry. See you soon, Jane. Hey, yo, anybody want to come to the park and play some chess with me? Hey, janitor, that was detention. We had to be there. You don't even work here no more. Hey, T, you want to waste your potential, too? Huh? Oh, come on, man. Hey, yo, Peanut, let's go get a game at the park, man. Come on. Nah, man, I don't like the politics. Oh, it's like that? Nicely done. Yep. 
What's up with Taheen? Why is he so attached to Clifton? Well, you know, Clifton was always the biggest kid in the class. Man. It's been like that since we was babies. And T, man, he's just as scared to be on the streets as me, but he's not gonna say nothing. You're a good man, Peanut. And this is for you. It's official. You're president of the chess club. Chess club? It's just you and me. We don't even have a homeroom, man. Everybody has that. Well, it is what it is. It's beautiful. It's where it's all gonna happen. What's gonna happen? A bonfire? You gotta have a little vision, Peanut. Sure, need some work. But when I look at this place, I see a mansion of possibilities. Hello? Katrina, it's your father. I can't talk right now. Oh, I understand. Uh, maybe later. Is everything all right? Oh, no, yeah, everything's fine. I just, uh, you know, I, wa I wanted to tell you that I, I, I was, I'm thinking about opening up a community chess house. There's some pretty good little players at that school. A chess house? How are you gonna be able to afford that? Well, I've been, I've been looking around a little bit. A lot of these houses have been foreclosed on. I could probably rent one for next to nothing. You know, Billy lent me some money already. Katrina, I know things aren't exactly right between us. But maybe they can't be for those kids. Since when do you care so much about kids, Eugene? Since I lost you. How goes it, gentlemen? <sighs> nice place you got here, Chessman. They come with asbestos. Hey, if you're not here to help, Clifton, you're more than welcome to leave. Oh, that's cool. We just came for Peanut. Peanut? Peanut? He ain't going nowhere. He's working. Working for who? For you? Peanut. He paying you? Come on, Cliff. No, you got W-2s? I mean, was that an interview process? Let me see your resume. Please, come on. Yo, if you don't want to go, man, just let him stay. No, he's coming. Let's go. I just told you he stays. Now, if you want to throw your life away, so be it. But he's with me. What's up, son? Hey, 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 it's cool, it's cool, it's cool, it's cool, it's cool, it's cool. Please. I'm here for you, son. Hear me? Alliance. Take this thing. All right. I'll tell you come with me. You know, stay with the car. Alone? Alone? Little Pee Wee don't want to stay alone. All right. T, you stay with the car. Pino, you bring your simple stuff with me. Yo, Cliff, I don't think that's a shut up. Stay focused, man, I right? Let's go, Peanut! You have to envision the end game. Anytime you find yourself behind, your mind got you there. 
Let me get up here. You let me do the talking, right? Don't trip. I got you. So what's up? What y'all got? No. This is the king. The king is your life. One mistake. And it can be taken. I could see if you cheat me from over here. Big Chair Chess Club. You stay right there. I'm on my way. As I stand in this empty home, I feel like I'm all alone. Didn't know it was coming. The girls left the door unlocked. Didn't know you would be gone so soon. Didn't know it was coming. I stood in this empty room That's why I feel like I'm all alone Feel like I'm all alone As I stand in this empty home I feel like I'm all Alone, thought you'd always be with me. I thought you'd be by my side. Thought we'd share life together. Hi, Dean. Now I'm taking How are you doing? I'm gonna miss him, too. He was always really sweet. I don't know about all that. Ooh, your team. Yo, let's ride, man. We're going down to Spider. I'm good. <laughs> Look, man, I miss the little guy, too. But that's how life is on these streets, man. I'm gonna make the run myself this time. 
And I hope we can put this behind us. Be your safe. What's up, Shay? <laughs> Are you okay? A young man is dead because of me. I should have never let him go. It's not true and you know it. You know what? For the first time in my life, I am actually very proud of you. You started something here. They don't listen, Trini. They don't listen. I didn't. Your brother doesn't. They see that easy money is the only way out. And you know what? Sometimes I, I don't blame them for thinking that way. So you're just going to give up? I think they think I'm nuts, OK? Trini, they think I'm loony. And you know what? I'm starting to believe him. <laughs> I'm starting to believe him. You ain't nuts. Clifton, he's nuts, but you... You ain't. Right. Two, a one, two, three, four. Are y'all ready for the all-time great? The all-time greatest. Yeah, yeah. They say life is what you make it, baby, and you done made it hard. Enjoys company and company thinks misery's a fraud. Everybody now you ain't got to turn your nose up on the counter me saying what's true. Come on, come I just calls it like I sees it, baby. When I sink it, I sink it on you. Everybody now I was told by a man so old that when he spoke, time stood still. He said, whichever road you decide to take in life, it's gonna start up here. Baseline. Now I want you to take this with you, baby, and let it marinate in your skull. See, sometimes life's about pushing and pulling and baby, you ain't got no pull. Bring up the they say life is what you make it, baby, and you done made it hard. Come See, on. misery enjoys company, and company thinks misery's a fraud. Everybody's now, you ain't got to turn your nose up on the counter, me saying what's true. I just cause it like I seize it, baby, when I see oh. it, I see it, I'm like, you. City to the country, we all get hungry, and everybody wants their own little app of luxury. Now, fellas, be up front with me, and don't try to front on me, and ladies, don't be ugly. Now, push, 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 now pull. pull. Come on, now push, push. This is a key. See that? This is how it works. Any questions?
man, what the hell you doing waking me up, man? Don't you walk away from me. I ain't your mama. touch nobody. Well, what do you think that's going to prove? I was locked up for 17 years in prison. I just got out. I spent almost two decades in the joint. I blamed everything on everybody else but me. I was just touching the pieces, moving them. Whenever I could, without thought. That's why none of y'all can get nothing over on me. So I've done all the dumb stuff that y'all have done twice. Some of it three times. What you do? Whatever I wanted to do. I stole. I even ran a crew. And they gave you 17 years for that? No. I got my 17 years for armed robbery. I robbed a bank. Cops came and we all scattered. And I took the fall. And then I learned. What did you learn? I learned the board. Yeah, move. Good. Check me. Even better. Thank you. This chess house, it's, I mean, it's amazing. <laughs> you know, eight years I've been at Maud Alton and, um, I've just been trying to make do with what little money they give us. We're all doing the best we can, you know, most of us. High ups, teachers, parents, kids. And in all my years, I have seen very few people make a real difference. Yeah. These kids, they need you. And your life before, and who you have become now, you inspire me, Mr. Brown. You really do. Well, it's really coming together. This Taheem Sanders is a beast. Talked to Marco last week. Really? He's coming home early. That's good news. Can I drive you to pick him up? I don't know. Oh, no, no, no. Trina, you got it. You got to do this for me. It would mean a lot to me. I got to be there for him when he gets out. Show him how much I changed. Please. Sunday. That's what I'm talking about.
That's nice. In a better place now, anyways. Yeah. You alright? You know you got a ticket out of this place, Tahim. You can be a special player, a real pro. Just need the discipline. Check this out. This could be you. Maurice Ashley did it. Who's to say you couldn't be next? Maurice who? Ah. Maurice Ashley from Harlem. He's the first African-American grandmaster. So what, you telling me your brother's a grandmaster? Who's to say there could only be one? Why ain't you one? If I had your natural talent, I would be. Come on, man. I ain't about to be embarrassing myself in some white man's competition. You gonna think that way your entire life? Every time you get an opportunity, you gonna run away just because you're scared? I ain't scared. T, you have real talent. And that'll take you further than any money, race, class, any day of the week. You could play with these kids, man. And if I can't? It ain't about whether you can or you can't. It's about whether you will or you won't. Believe that. Where the hell you been, Tahim? I was out with Mr. Brown. <sighs> I want you to do something for me, okay? I want you to sign this consent form so I can play in the chess tournament. Chess tournament? <laughs> what the hell are you talking about? I told you, I've been getting real good at chess. Give me a damn break, Tahim. You out there playing some dumb ass game while the rest of us sitting in here trying to survive. It ain't a dumb game. Is it a job? You getting paid? Because if you ain't getting paid, I don't want to hear nothing about it. Silly. I'm good. Boy, you ain't good at nothing but being a pain in my ass. Get, get out my face. Go on. Go on, get out my face. Huh? How the hell you think you can afford to be in somebody's chess contest? You think they left fools like you in for free? Mr. Brown said he paid. Oh, hell no, he ain't. And you ain't gonna be in no chess contest either. No chess contest. Mr. Brown. Mr. Brown, I presume? Yes, sir. Jerry Simpson, assistant coordinator. It's a pleasure to have you here. Oh, it's a pleasure to be here, sir. What are, you, uh, what are all the computers for? That's how we play chess here. It's the wave of the future. I trust you, Houston. Yes, sir. <laughs> computers. All right, I want you to concentrate and picture your end game. What's with the computers? A modern way of playing. Man, that's bull. I want to play street staff. You are going to play on a computer and behave. You hear me? Now, listen. No trash talking, no cursing. Just play your game. No trash talking, no cursing. That is my game. They're ready to start. You need to register. Great. Great. All right. Give me your consent forms. Good. 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 Hello. Eugene Brown, registering the kids. And the eighth? Well, here's the thing. Actually, I left it in the car. My registration. Is there any possible way you think I could have enough time to go? If you're quick. Thank you so much.
All right, sir, you're all set. Great. Eugene Brown, I'm Leroy Woodbury, host a talk program over at KCAM. KCAM. Right, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, I just wanted to come by and tell you I heard about what you're doing over there at that house. Mm. It's good stuff. I got a sister who lives over that way. Oh, yeah? Yeah. yeah. Is he one of your students? Yeah, yeah. Tahim Sanders. Is he any good? Exceptional. Well, I just wanted to wish you good luck. Oh, hey. I'm sorry, I'm distracted. Uh, I haven't had jitters like this in years. Oh, come on, man. That's the fun part. And they recreated the beast where families get messed up and only couple really eat. Man, I ain't tripping. I know they really got heat and they ready to do some dumb stuff. Get them off of the street. That's why I got a couple dogs to rustle up these sheep and keep the party rocking like, oh, what a treat. We gon' take it to the top. I can't wait. We gon' take it to the top. Can't wait. Can't wait. We gon' take it to the top. I can't wait. We gon' take it to the top. We got moms in the kitchen and she cooked their rice. have a problem. After reviewing some of your students' forms, it's fairly obvious that one of them was forged. Now, Linda, over registration, alerted me to the fact that initially you didn't have some of these forms signed, so I took a look at them. And if you look, this one clearly was not signed by an adult. Now, you forged a consent form and, and failed to submit any of the students' birth certificates. Can I talk to you? I'm comfortable talking right here. So, some of these kids don't have birth certificates. <laughs> Everybody's got a birth certificate. Not where we come from. Then it's done. I'm sorry, but rules are rules. Alan wins. <sighs> no. Eugene, that was an absolute travesty, a crime. Wait. Well, there's nothing we can do about it right now. That's not necessarily true. Why don't you and Tahim come on the air tomorrow morning? State your case. Get the word out to the community. For those of you just tuning in, we are joined in studio by Tahim Sanders and his coach, Eugene Brown, who were robbed of a chess championship this past weekend at a local tournament. Now, tell us, Tahim, what happened? Shed some light on this most egregious theft of a championship. It wasn't theft. Come again? It was not theft. The rules were the rules, and we didn't obey them. <laughs> Mr. Brown, I, I was there. It is the job of Tahim 
and every every person playing the game, black or white, to beat them at their own game. Their own rules. We didn't do that. Mr. B, we won. We can't change the rules, Tahim. We have to learn to win within them. That's what this is about. But isn't creating a champion what this is all about? No, sir. No, it's not. It's about learning how to play the game. It's about changing minds. And in turn, learning about life. Championship isn't the end game. Championship is a byproduct. All right, then. Uh, there you have it. We'll be back in a minute, plus weather and traffic. What the hell is wrong with you, brother? You come down here just to sell your guy out on the air. He's making a point. Yeah, well, you did that. Tahim! It's Mr. Brown, Tahim. Not before Tahim ain't here. You who? Eugene Brown, ma'am. I'm sorry to bother you. But your son comes to my chest house. Not anymore, you don't. Please, Miss Sam. Listen, you go on and hustle somebody else's kid. Selling my baby all them lies, he gonna be a chess champion. Yeah, he gonna go to school for chess. You stay the hell away. You hear me? It ain't like that, Miss Sanders. I said stay the hell away. Miss Sanders. Sanders! Your son is the real deal. You need to come and see him play. Hear me? I wasn't there for my kids, and I regret it every day. Your son needs you. He needs you. Mr. B, what you doing up here at the Taj Mahal? Y'all seen Tahim? Yeah, he was with Clifton. They ran out some other dudes in a car I never seen before. Said he had a job or something about a, uh, the rec center. Rec center, huh? I think. All right. Hey, y'all come by the chess house tomorrow. We're having a mini tournament. All right, Mr. B. All right. <laughs> Tahim is in some real trouble. It's, it's amazing, because you're so good at caring about other people's kids and completely incapable of caring about your own. Marco! Oh, hey, man, it's good to have you home. Marco! Hey, 
Hey, Taheem, where you been, man? Huh? You in trouble, son? For what? Don't for what, me. I saw you get arrested outside the rec center. Man, I ain't get arrested. I was Cliff and some other guys. I thought you was with them. I was. I was in the car, but... Once I found out what they was doing, I just thought before I moved. Glad you made the right decision. Yes. You know, everybody else says you're a phony. I know you're not. It's a bit much, son. Some of these players are rated 2,400 and up. But it's in the district, and I want to play. For me and Peanut. Come on here, help me move these boxes. <laughs> Yeah. Yo, Clifton. Clifton. Surprise! Surprise! Yes. So it is. Don't you forget your own birthday? How'd you know that? Miss King and I spent a couple hours digging around City Hall. No more disqualifications. This time we're gonna beat them with their own rules. Come on, T. Make a wish. Yes. All right. I'm gonna go run some errands. I'm gonna be back. Thank you, Katrina. First off, don't be mad at Trini. She wanted no part of this. I'm sorry I pissed away the best years of my life. 
And they weren't the best years because I was a young man. They were the best years because I hadn't ruined your trust yet. <laughs> I don't even know you. I'm trying to change that. I need your son. I love you, Marco. I always will. No matter what. Hi, Miss Rivas. Principal King said I can make an announcement. Attention, attention. I would like to announce that our very own Tahim Sanders will be participating in the Eastern Champion Open Chess Tournament this upcoming Sunday. Everyone is encouraged to come on down and watch him kick some... Watch him dominate the competition. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I got somebody I want you to meet. Sir, this here is the chess man. Taught me everything I know right here in these walls. So, to him, he's good, I guess. Real good. Unstudied, undisciplined. Talking to him, man. Huh? <laughs> Big tournament, huh? You ready? As I'll ever be. Son, these cats are quick. You gotta be quicker. And because of what you look like, all eyes will be on you. Mm -hmm. So you gotta think tough. Hmm? Now this kid, Jay Thomas Gaines. Whew, I wish I had a shot at him. <laughs> I got me a list of his last 300 matches. Got it sent to me by a chess magazine. Felt bad that I was all locked up. Free subscription for life. Hmm? If you face off with his games, he's got one particular move that leaves him vulnerable, almost without fail. Amazing how nobody found it before, but then again, nobody's got as much time on their hands as I do. So listen carefully. You know he will relentlessly pound you with his queen. No. No what? Look, I appreciate all this. I really do. I just... This is something I have to do by myself. Respect? <laughs> Anything else, then? You ever getting out of here? Only my mind gets out. Every time I open up that board, every time I open up a Bible, and it will be out when you are playing in that tournament. Tahim Sanders checking in. Okay. Put him in the section. Yep. Okay. Good luck, son. Thanks. You recognize that face? J. Thomas Gaines, huh? The one and only.
concentrate here. Women weak in legs. It's chess. What I need my legs for? Concentrate here. Good afternoon, everyone, and welcome to the Washington, D.C. Chess Open. As is customary, please shake your opponent's hand. Very good. Now start your clocks. players in the country since he was 15. Anybody can be beat. Even games. Gentlemen, our two undefeated players, J. Thomas Gaines and Taheem Sanders, will engage in an Armageddon tiebreak to determine our chess open champion. Gentlemen, good luck. Hey. 
One good. Mr. Brown, my name is Daniel Norton with Urban League. Yes, ma'am. This Tahim, has he made any college plans yet? Because I'd like to help. I'll be in touch. Hey, that's the first time I've been scared all year. You ain't got to try and make me feel better. You know that, right? Uh, trust me. I wouldn't do that. Ever. Hey, grab me a quick photo over here. Mr. Brown. Ready, guys? Dad. Glad you could make it. Yeah, well, you know, thought I'd just check it out. I'm happy to see you, son. Yeah. Let me show you her. All right. Forwards. Champions. Back here we have the kitchen. 